Hello guys, welcome back to Technopedia and in this video we are gonna review the CM13 ROM for the Canvas A1 which is Android 1 phone. So let's get started. Okay, let's turn the phone up. Here's the boot animation from CM. Okay, here's the lock screen. Here's the CM room. Let's jump into the settings first and see the Android version. As you can see the Android version is 6.0.1 and the CM version is 13. Here's the Flappy Bird like game. The notification bar. Some other information about the phone. We have also got the OTA updates with this room. A really cool feature. Okay, yeah, the SIM cards. This phone supports two SIM cards. Here's, here are the sound options. And here's the automatic music app launch while headsets are connected. Here are the themes, currently we are on the default theme but we can also download more themes from play store. Okay. Then here are the display options, the live display, we have got the night mode and the day mode as you can see. We have also got the 180 degree rotation, it's working flawlessly as you can see, no problem with it. Okay. Here is the double tap to sleep option, as you can see it's also working great. Here's the cast clean, expanded desktop, okay. here's the LCD density and the daydream. Okay. Here's the lock screen. We can also set the live lock screen, as you can see currently it's showing the default wallpaper. Now let's turn on the live lock screen, okay. as you can see all the colors are coming up now, so a cool feature. You can also set a lock screen message, here are the lock screen shortcuts can set any app which we want as a shortcut for the lock screen as you can see we can set any desired app according to our requirement We can also change the lock screen wallpaper. Let's see. Oops, currently it's dating. Let's switch it on. 
as you can see now the wallpaper appears here are some other options battery information we have the battery saver also and automatic activation on 5 or 15 percentage here's the memory this phone has got 1 GB of memory currently Android OS is using 315 MB which is higher than all other apps You can also set the system profile. Here are the accessibility options. Okay. Here are the developer options. This room has also got the feature of multi window. Let's see if we have any option for that. Oh, yes, as you can see, here is the option, and it is already turned on. Let's see if it works. Yes, as you can see, it works flawlessly. This is really a cool feature. Here is the dialer app, same as the lollipop. Here is the messaging app, the browser, the camera app. The camera is talk based. Here's the music app. Okay. Here's the default player. Here's the album art on the lock screen. It looks really, really amazing. Here are the audio effects. You can change all the settings and set different modes for speaker and headset as well. Here is the calculator app. The default app. Here is the snapchat, it's working really great, we have used it, As you can see how quick it's working. Yes, it's responsive. Here is the file manager default cm file manager we can change the look of this file manager as well one of the great thing is this rom has got fm radio also which was missing in previous cm rom so it was a much awaited feature Here is the clock app. It's almost similar to the previous rooms. The emoji switcher app is also working, but it needs a working data pack for that.
we'll have a look at it later on we also got the screen recorder app also as you can see the screen recording has started Overall the ROM is very snappy but we will let you know about the perks later on after using this ROM for a while. As you can see we can also scroll status bar for more options we can also add more tiles to it and remove them as well Here are the wallpapers. Got so many cool wallpapers by default. Here's the advanced reboot option. See, okay, as you can see, now we have got four different options for reboot menu. Okay. So that was it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to the channel.